In the city of Albuquerque says graffiti across the city is on the rise and they're moving quickly to keep up with this problem. News 13's George Gonzalez tagged along with cleanup crews this morning. He's live on 2nd Street in Santa Fe with the story. George. We well, yeah, had it is vandalism like this right behind me that has solid waste crews working seven days a week, hoping to give the city a better look. Tags, throwies, throwies or bubble letters, fill ins, outlines, just it's it's vast. Seaton, who's worked with the city's Department of Solid Waste for 20 years, says while it varies, calls for graffiti removal are highest during the summer months. Seeing it anywhere from alleyways and arroyos to bike paths and just anywhere vandals see fit. We'll be steady busy for, it's hard to say, for a while. and It's just like a wave. It's like a roller coaster. Graffiti's up and down a lot. The Department of Solid Waste says calls for graffiti cleanup across the city in the past year are up by more than 1,500 incidents. Cleanup crews saying reports made to 311 have played a huge part. The C-Click fix helps a lot because it gives a pinpoint. I recommend using that for the public because it gives a pinpoint of exactly where the graffiti's at if they send it exactly where it's at. And that kind of helps because sometimes the we get wrong directions a lot and sometimes we go in circles looking for a tag. Seton says while the cleanup crew composed of 19 full-time employees attempts to tackle graffiti seven days a week, the cleanup is a never-ending battle. That's part of the, the, the game we signed up for. It's, it's part of our job and it's just one of the, the things that happens. We clean it and they put it right back up. And the city says it spends about $1.6 million a year to clean up graffiti. Back to you. George, thank you. The city encourages people to use the 311 system to let them know when they find graffiti. The city's graffiti removal is free.